Welcome back to MidMichigan Matters. Students across MidMichigan have already started school or are heading back very soon. Today was the first day of classes for students at Jackson College. Today we welcome Dr. Alitris Brown, Jackson College's Chief Student Services Officer and Vice President of Student Services. Welcome, Thank Dr. You. Brown. Thanks for joining us. And what is the appeal to a community college? A community college is a great place where students can come and they can actually earn a certificate, multiple degrees, associates, and in our case we actually do offer a bachelor's degree as well as offering an opportunity for students to take a three plus one program with us where they can earn a bachelor's degree with some of our uh, sister schools. No matter if it's community college or regular four-year college, it's very expensive. Governor Gretchen Whitmer recently signed into law legislation uh, providing the reconnect program for community college mm -hmm. offering free community colleges to those who qualify uh, tell us how that's going to play out in the semester and the year ahead well we're really excited about that that free community college regulation that was signed was amazing. It will give all of the students an in-district rate at their local community college and in some cases if the students are eligible for Pell Grants they're also eligible for a thousand dollar bonus. Okay and for more than a decade Jackson College's Office of Inclusive Excellence has been helping students. How does this program uh, work with the community at Jackson College? The, the program is great. It gives us an opportunity to reach all students, not just certain populations of students, but really reach out into the community and get other students to come in from a variety of backgrounds, specifically the ones who are eligible for the Pell Grants because they get the additional funding sources. We've heard a lot over the past few months about the problems with FAFSA, uh, yes. the student aids uh, that people are getting and all the uh, nuances with that. How are you handling that with your students? It has been challenging, yeah. but we have overcome it. I mean, we work with our students very closely. We talk to them daily. We help address their needs when they have needs arise. And we have a direct contact with the federal government. So we reach out to the Department of Education if we have questions, yeah. because asking one question leads to yeah a bunch of other responses yes. <laughs> for other people. So we've been helpful. And Dr. Brown, on Wednesday, the school is hosting Jet Jam. Yes. What is Jet Jam? Tell us about that. Jet Jam is an exciting, it's it's our opening events. We have on Tuesday and Thursday, sandwiching Jet Jam, we have waffles. But at Jet Jam, <laughs> we have a variety <laughs> of activities and events for students to come out and participate in. And they get to do a lot of really fun things. So we're really yeah. excited about it. And yeah. they can also register to vote. So. Yeah, oh good. That's a good bonus to that as well. Yes. All right, thanks for joining us, Dr. Brown. We appreciate your time. Thank you for having me. Good luck with the new school year. Thank you, we're excited. All right, and it should be a little cooler on Wednesday, right, uh, Justin Bradford? For